talking kind of low right now because I just put Blake to sleep. Um, she was a little fussy, so, you know, it's around the time for her nap. So, um, I put her to sleep, and while she's napping, it's the perfect time to do my hair. So, today I'll be doing a twist out. I'll show you guys how I do my twist outs. Um, first, I have to wash this hair. <laughs> it's, it's about that time. So, I'll be washing it and I'll be trying out the Camille Rose products. Um, yesterday I just went and got some. Um, typically I use Shea Moisture, but um, I'm using Camille Rose products today. So um, I got the conditioning custard conditioner. I'll just show you everything that I bought yesterday. Um, I got the cleansing rinse, the sweet ginger cleansing rinse. Oh, and this is Moroccan pear um, conditioning custard. I got the coconut water leave-in detangling hair treatment. Basically, leave-in conditioner. Typically, I'll use the Kinky Curly Knot today. This is what I usually use. I was a little short on the bottle that I had, so I just went ahead and bought another bottle. I was almost out. So, um, But I'm not going to use this one today. This one works perfectly like I this is my go-to this is my favorite leave-in um conditioner so I'm just today I this I swear by this stuff <laughs> so um just today though I'll try the Camille Rose give this a shot and I'll let you guys of course know how it how I like it um or how it works for my hair because what works for mine may not work for anyone else so um I also got the um deep conditioner And I got the Twisting Butter by Camille Rose as well. And for edge control, I tried this. My niece told me about this. The Hicks Edge Control for my edges. Now, after um, I had Blake, I, I don't know why. And, like, I never, I never wear my, like, puffs on my ponytails really really tight but when I looked it up I heard about this thing called um, postpartum hair loss I didn't lose a lot of hair it's just around my edges it got really thin after I had Blake but it is growing back right now I'll show you guys what I'm talking about see like it got maybe I show I'm gonna wash it first before I show you guys so you can kind of see exactly what I'm talking about like it's a tad bit thin right here. Um, after I had my daughter, she, um, you know, it got like that. My hair, I have never had, um, I've never had thin edges ever. So, um, yeah, that, it has to be that. I don't wear my puffs tight. I don't wear tight styles, anything like that. So, um, yeah, that's what that was from. So, so if you want to see how I do my twist outs. Just watch. conditioner um camille rose shampoo and conditioner this stuff smells so good so good um so now typically at this point i usually use my kinky curly not today but i'm gonna use the leave-in conditioner to detangle my hair 
Um, so I use this twice, actually. I use it right after I shampoo and condition before deep conditioning. And then after I wash the deep conditioner, I'll, I'll put more back in. So um, you may, some people may say it's double, I don't know, working, but whatever. That works for me. So that's what I do. So I'll show you guys what I do. So to detangle, I'll put my hair in four parts. And then I'll um, apply the um, leave-in conditioner or detangler. So here we go.
deep conditioning cap on my head and with the plastic cap too. I'm about to sit under the dryer. This is the dryer that I use. Um, it's pretty much the little like on the go ones, I guess. Not on the go, but like not the hooded dryer, but the kind you can sit down with. Or I should say not the old fashioned hooded dryers. The one, these are the ones you can like, I don't know, sit on the sofa with. And um, I forgot the name of them. I, once I remember, I'll put them down and I'll put the name of it down in the, in the, uh, the comments. Um, this is the little cap that you put on. You tie it. So while I do this, I just want to mention that I was not a fan of that coconut water leave-in conditioner. I don't know if I'm just biased because I, I really, really like the kinky curly knot today, but it did not work as well as this one did on my hair. Um, like I said, it's just me, but I was not a fan of that. When I was detangling my hair, when I got to like this back section I had, even though it was a, a larger section. I had to, I guess, add more and more of that stuff um, to detangle it. But yeah, it, it really, it didn't really work as well for me. So, all right. So, I'll sit under the dryer, let the deep conditioner work for like maybe 15 to 20 minutes. And then I'll wash it out. So, I'll be back. Conditioning custard, the conditioner, and I love the shampoo. It did a really good job cleansing my hair. Um, I did not like the leave-in conditioner or detangler. I did not like that. I'll be going back to my kinky curly, not today. This does the job every single time. So um, now it's time to do my twist my two strand twist. So since I didn't like the detangler, the Camille Rose detangler, I'll just use my um, my Kinky Curly Not Today leave-in conditioner. All right. And I just put it in throughout my hair Put a good bit into I'm very generous with that.
Thank you.